Hey guys, today we're reading the Cursed Zootopia Abortion Trilogy. If you guys want us to have the first male-on-male -male abortion, then get this video to 25,000 likes. And subscribe so you don't miss the next video. <laughs> the next abortion. I will survive a Zootopia fan comic by Morba. Tap. You're reading it like a manga, bro. That's the other one. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. I'm so <laughs> stupid. Come on. Let's go, sweet cheese. <laughs> Nick! Nick! Nick, come on. Wake up. Grumble. We're off duty today, bitch. Nick, I have something important to say. Just text me, bro. Nicholas! I am serious. Okay, okay. Why does he say like, okay? Oh my god, look at the position that they put these two characters in. Hot. And he has the star of David, too. Why is there a star of David in between? Jeez, when you, when you call me Nicholas, it means that I'm in great danger. You bet. <sighs> hey, take a shower and two other things before you ruin the rest of my day? Yes, it'd be good, I think. What is he gonna do in the shower? <laughs> He'd make jerk off noises. That's what he's doing in the fucking shower. Wow, I'm feeling much better now. After you rubbed one out. What is this important thing you want me to know? I'm pregnant. <gasps> Get me out of here! I don't want to be in here anymore! <laughs> nice try, Fluff. You almost got me. We've been using furry condoms for months now. Twitch. She's on Twitch? Y your your nose is twitching, so it means- Carrots! Are you sure? I, I pulled out. Yes. Yes, it is. Your pull-out game week. I just took a pregnancy test in- Oh, Judy, this is the happiest day of my life. I've never used a cop to- Oh my god. This is not what I expect. I thought that- Because obviously we know they're about to have an abortion. And the fact that he is so happy that- I'm like, oh god. But Judy ain't, bro. Look at Judy. Judy, she looks hot, but like she's not, she's not ready. She's hot or not, bro. I love you, Judy. I love you so much. You've made me the happiest mammal on earth. <laughs> Nick, please stop, stop. Oh, sorry, Judy Chan. I didn't hurt you, did I? No, Nick, you didn't. But this isn't the problem. Problem? Like <laughs> troll face? Because <laughs> they're from different species? You think our baby might have some problem, like an incest baby or something? That is a very genuine concern to be having in this situation right now. That that wasn't what I meant. I don't understand. Nick, please, don't make things worse for us. Judy, what are you talking about? Nick, I don't want this child. <gasps> Dude, th this is like an NTR manga, right? This is like NTR <laughs> motherfucker walking in. No! I can't, I can't believe you even said that. Nick, hear me out. Please tell me I heard wrong. Why, Judy? Why? Let me explain, Nick! I have to kill the baby! So explain yourself! Why don't you want our baby? There's no baby yet. I'm just in my first month of pregnancy. This is so weird. <laughs> <laughs> Seeing Judy Hobbs talking about pregnancy is insane. With that fat ass sticking out too, it's a little distracting. It, the booty is big. And you decided on your own that this is gonna be the last month, ain't you? <laughs> Let's talk about it. Like adults, right? Okay, tell your tale, bitch. <laughs> so tell heavy. your tale, bro. Well, at first I believed you couldn't get me pregnant. That's why I let you raw dog me countless times. <laughs> <laughs> damn right, Judy, damn right. Yes, I do know there are some cases of interbreeding. What? This is so weird. Oh my God, look at all these children. This is fucked up. This implies that a human could be fucking any of these animals right now in this society. Isn't that our dream come true? We can get with Judy! But they're extremely rare, and none of them involved a couple formed by a pred and a prey. <laughs> a pred. So I foolishly believed we didn't have to take any precautions. No them forever. But how wrong I was. I still don't understand why you... Because I'm... Afraid. Afraid of what? Well, in part, I fear our child might be, you know, some kind of freak. <laughs> Look at that thing. What, they got the fucking Naruto six tail fox or whatever inside of her? Like, what is that? Yeah, that's badass. I want that to come out of my pussy. Why not? It isn't impossible. Moreover, fucking bitch saying moreover. Shut the fuck up. Moreover, a baby of yours might be grabs pussy. A little too big for me. Her pussy. 
He's big, but not that big. Nobody knows how huge my pussy is, and it scares me. So what you're saying is, hey, Nick, even if you can get me pregnant, I still don't want to have any children. <laughs> Did I hit the mark, Judy? You don't like my fucking s***? Nick, I should have had this talk with you earlier, and I'm really sorry for not doing so. And you have no idea how hard it is for me to have to tell you these things. But I must say there is another good reason. And it is... My career! What?! You know I'm about to be promoted to lieutenant, and if I accept this risky pregnancy, my career will be halted for months or years. My pussy might never recover. <laughs> it won't, it won't recover. In the worst case scenario, if I suffer any sequela. What the fuck is that? I don't even know what that means. Judy Hopps be fucking studying the dictionary like crazy. Look at the panel here. They replaced her body. <laughs> it's just her pussy. It's just the pussy. He is speaking to us right now. It's not only my life and my career that are in danger here, Nick. I became a symbol, an inspiration to all those small mammals out there who also want to make Zootopia a better place to live. The more I am successful in my career, the more they get confident in their own abilities. For this cause and to make this dream come true, I did my best and I sacrificed many pregnancies. Many pre She's had so many abortions already. She has been slinging shit all over town. She's been throwing them. And I don't want to let let those achievements slip through my p like sand. That's it. Your career? I should have known you were gonna throw it in my face, but you surprised me, Judy. I thought I knew you, but I was wrong. You don't have the right to say that to me! Cor, you don't have the right to be <laughs> slaying these lines right now. Cor is given 110% vocal <laughs> performance. I'm acting like I really got a fetus in my fucking asshole right now. <laughs> You know who I am. You know what I am. You know what's at stake for me since we first met. And you know full well that I did everything for your career. For my career. Yes, I do know. It seems like you could even kill our baby for your career. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, he slapped him. <laughs> the face is so good. What the fuck? <laughs> bro, did Oda write this? I I have to clap, bro. That's the most beautiful frame in any manga I've read in my entire life. Ouch. Nick! Ouch. Nick, Ouch. forgive me! I lost my temper. I'm walking out, bitch. See you later. Minecraft door closed sound effect. I'm getting my condoms, but I'm taking them. No condoms forever. He's getting his condoms and he's throwing them in the fucking trash. Nick, I beg you, please forgive me. Don't cancel me on Twitter because I beat you. Please don't leave me this way. I need you. I need you now more than ever. Trust me when I say I still love you, Nick. To my son, Nicholas. With love. Splish. 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 I have one droplet of cum falling onto the picture. Judy? Um? What would have happened if your mother, while pregnant with you, had decided to interrupt <laughs> her pregnancy? Nick, it's useless. I know what you- I'll tell you what would have happened. But if you hadn't been born, Judy, this world would be as bleak as ever. And without your light, I'd still be on the streets living a meaningless life. That's not true, Nick. I'm sure you would. Judy, listen, there are people who make a difference in the world, and you are one of them. Even being a little bunny, you stopped an absurdly nasty conspiracy and helped change the minds and hearts of millions. And to me, things like these could never ever happen to without you. For God's sake, Judy, give this unborn child the opportunity to do the same. I beg you, please don't put the fucking clothes hanger up your fucking computer. <laughs> No, as I said before, it's useless. Sorry, Nick, but I've made up my mind. My body, my rules. My body, my rules. Damn. Yo. My, my question with this is, why the fuck does this have to be the Zootopia characters? What purpose does this add to the story at all? Think about it, Nick. He's a fox. What color of fox is red? He's a Republican. And she, she wears blue. She's a Democrat. The political divide in this country is sexism, people. Open your eyes, ladies and gentlemen. Nick, don't go away. Please, stay with me. Let's talk more about this. Do you want to talk? Well, there's something I'd like to know. Why didn't you keep it a secret from me? I mean, why didn't you just get rid of the fucking baby without me knowing anything? That would be... 
<laughs> terribly immoral. Wow, that seems like a much obviously more terrible thing to do. It wouldn't be the most honest thing to do. What? I thought you deserved to know. It would have been better for you, for us, if you'd kept me in the dark about your premeditated sin. Nick, where are you going? I will survive. Oh my god, he has a battle scar. He has a- Oh, what, did you fall down the stairs? Did you trip in the shower? Nick, if you walk out the door, you don't have to come back anymore. Nick! Nick! Oh no! No! <laughs> It's honestly kind of convincing, low-key. But then you think about it for two seconds and you're like, these are the fucking Zootopia characters. You know what I mean? Nothing lasts forever. Even in an apparently everlasting love. <laughs> that has triumphed over the odds and many challenges. Many eventually come to end. End. Oh, oh, that was the title. I when he said I will survive, that was the title of the fucking comic. Cause he will survive. That baby ain't surviving though. <laughs> That's funny. That's like really funny. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I'll be Judy now. Bang, bang, bang. Born to be alive. A Zootopia fan comic by Borba. Judy! Come on! Open the door! I know you're home. Click, click, click. Go away, Nick. It's 2 a.m. What? <laughs> <laughs> Besides, you're being quite noisy. Can't you just knock on the door? If you're going to make such a fuss again, I'll have no choice but to arrest you for disorderly conduct. Is that all you've said to me after a year? It's been a year, Daddy? Leave me alone, Nick, and never come back. Ah! Nick, away from the door. No, I need to talk with you face to face. Face. What is so important that made you come here at this time? Let me in and I'll tell you everything, Judy. But believe me, if I don't talk with you right now, I might not have another day to live. This threatening suicide right now? <laughs> or maybe he's dying of like a disease. All right, I'll, I'll let you in. Step back just a little bit, Nick. I think Judy's voice has changed completely in every subsequent panel. <laughs> Sorry, dude, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm not a voice actor. It's dark in here, like your womb. <laughs> the apartment looks the same. Everything is in its place. You did Come here to talk about the furniture, did you? Jeez, how cold-hearted you are tonight. Nick, I'm not in the mood for your antics. Mickey Mouse had an <laughs> abortion now? What? That's crazy. I must be on duty at 8 a.m., so... Yeah, I do know. This is the first time we've met in many months. Yet you only think about your job. Listen, it was not me who resigned from the police force. Unlike you, I have my duties. By the way, is it the alcohol that made you come here to see me again? So he d became an alcoholic <laughs> because his girlfriend decided to get an abortion without even like discussing it with him. He's a very religious man. Like this is the worst thing that could have possibly happened for him. He's a Christian fundamentalist. It'd be nice if you'd have some coffee for me. What? Do you want some coffee right now? Tommy in it did not get an abortion. I want some coffee right now. I'm not built for this. You can just use your normal voice. Do you want some coffee? That's your normal voice? Is that what you think your normal voice sounds like? <laughs> I don't know what my normal voice is anymore. I'm trying my best. Do you want some coffee right now? Why does it become British <laughs> Mickey Mouse? I don't want British Mickey Mouse in here. I want to see Judy fucking hops in her fat fucking ass. Wait, there's a crazy thing in the next panel. Our bitches. Our bitches. New veg burger. Why is it our bitches? Let me see. Yes, here you are. Still with some coffee. I just have to warm it up a little. Hot, hot. Ah. I'm feeling better now. Minutes ago, you said your life was <laughs> at stake. Well, did I say that? Well, yeah, it seems like I did. Just as I suspected, you lied to me. No, I only hustled you a bit. The Riz is back. No, the Riz is no, back. Riz is no, back. no. So your old self is back <laughs> alive and well. Didn't I tell you, Fluff? I always survive. Nick, you son of a... Oopsie. Ha, <laughs> ha. By the by, say, did you do that? That? You mean my premeditated sin? Wow! Oh my, did I really say such a thing? <laughs> 
sorry for this nonsense, Judy. Yes, Nick. I did. I killed that baby. They skipped the abortion arc. They made the artistic choice to not show the, the abortion in full. The art is a mate. Can we talk about how the art? The art, it feels like a porn comic that never starts. It's like when I read fucking Yaoi and it's like 20 pages of story and then they fuck for two pages. You read Yaoi? Yeah, on occasion. I'm more invested in this than I am in the movie. This should have been the plot for Zootopia Plus because those Zootopia Plus episodes were dog water. Dude, Zootopia Minus. Because it's on the pregnancy test. Uh, I was going to say Zootopia Minus because minus the fetus. I forgive. I don't need your forgiveness. No, Judy. You've got me wrong. Forgive me. Swish. Toby. Nick. I miss you, Judy. I miss you so much. Nick, stop this and stand up. Judy, please hear me out. I did you wrong. I should have never left you. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I should have stayed by your side. I should have stayed by your pussy. You asked me to stay, but I refused to listen to you. I'm proud enough to turn my back on you. To leave you was the hardest thing I ever did. Oh my god! He was fucking a llama? <laughs> <laughs> to leave you was the hardest thing I ever did, but my pride pulled me away from you. From your love, Judy. I thought I'd be fine, but I could forget you. But how stupid and wrong I was. <laughs> Yo! I don't know, man. Like, that might have been an upgrade. Like, I, I know Judy got it, but like... She a baddie, she knows she a 10, bro. Look at the money! He fucking paid I regret bitterly for letting you face your ordeal by yourself. I was such a shameful coward, but believe me, Judy, I've learned my lesson and changed my ways. I get abortions all the time now. I'm begging you, Judy. Could you please forgive my past errors and many flaws? What do you say? Will you do so and take me back? Oh, Nick. Nick. I didn't know you foxes were so emotional. <laughs> what a fucking asshole. That's your response to that? However, you walked out on me when I needed you most. But... Sure. It's my turn to talk. Exclamation point. Yes, I do know that we both made many mistakes and bad choices. But you did the worst of them all by turning your back on me. Judy, I... Oh my god, they're about to show the procedure. Oh my god! Let's fucking go! Where were you when the procedure went wrong? Do you know how much... I missed you by my side when I was going through such a dreadful time! Oh my god, Eden. How do you reach that fucking <laughs> register? My eardrums are going to die! Do you forget that you were as guilty of my pregnancy as me? If you really loved me, you would have been strong enough to stay with me. That's all I asked for, Nick. Your support. Instead, you gave me the cold shoulder and walked out on me. She's grabbing the pussy again. Maybe everything would have been quite different if you had stayed by my side. Anyway, all these things oh. are in the past now. And yes, Nick, I forgive you for being such a shameful coward. It's too late for a reconciliation. I'm sorry, Nick. It's time for you to go. Love a dub a dub dub. Yeah. What's up? It's Rick and Morty. Let's get that rabbit abortion. Oh, love a love a dub dub. Judy, please give me a chance. I can't live without you. Nick, you're hurting me. Let me go. Let me. <gasps> Are you, you okay? Need, need, need help? She a lesbian now? She a lesbian? She knows she a 10? Shay, I told you to stay in bed. I can deal with Nick by myself. Judy, who's this woman? And why was she in our bed? Oh no, no, no. You replaced me with another fox of female fox i think you'd better say dixon <laughs> what a bitch <laughs> how come you many things happened while you were away nick when you went away i was naked i was booty cheeks out to the whole world twerking <laughs> whoa i felt totally miserable and alone i could not count on the support of my family not that's everything i put them through when i became a police officer even though at the end of the first movie they accepted me this is not canon this is not this is bullshit and especially after the two of us started to live together without being married. You know they're carrot carathlics. <laughs> <laughs> what? The most forced pun I've ever seen. 
I didn't expect them to somehow accept my decision to interrupt my pregnancy. In the end, I stood up for myself and went ahead with the procedure. Of course, I kept my family unaware of what I was doing and what happened next. As the first rabbit to ever get an abortion. <gasps> what? She was the first rabbit to ever get an abortion. She's a trailblazer, man. She's a p blazer. That's so cool. Unfortunately, complications happened and I had to get help at the ZPD's hospital. And it was there where I first met Shannon, my ray of sunshine in those dark times. She works as a garage mechanic at ZPD and came to the hospital due to a motor minor injury. Why are you turning into Mitch McConnell? She's sweet and shy and like me <laughs> has gone through a stressful breakup. We became friends and began to cheer each other up. That doesn't explain why you... Things are not just black or white, Nick. This comic is. <laughs> There's a large gray area in between, and she and I are well aware of what's in the middle of it. Even we were greatly surprised. But I feel excited to change. No! No! I've had enough! You're not like that, Judy. You're just fooling yourself. Please dump this Lezzy and get back to your true self. Lezzy! He dropped Lezzy on her? I've never heard that in my goddamn life. Don't you dare call her that. Let her go! Let her bug off! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Shay! Shay! Are you alright? Oh my... Sorry, I didn't want... Nick is so bad and he's so unapologetically terrible. It's like revenge because remember in the first chapter, she beat him and so he beats her girlfriend. It's the cycle of violence. Get out of my home now. Judy, please, I came here for you. Yeah, Nick, you came here out of the blue from outer space with a sad story, hoping I was all alone and free. <laughs> from outer space? What the fuck does that mean? This panel. Oh my God. God. <laughs> that is hot. That is hot, bro. I'm not gonna lie. This artist has got to have so much fetish art. It is insane. Where's their Patreon, bro? I'm trying to donate. I need to get my own panel. Oh, no, Nick. Not high. I found me a new love with someone who respects me. With her, I got a new life to live to start anew because I deserve to live a new life, Nick. I was born to be alive. Title drop. Judy, please. Do yourself a favor and get Get out of my life forever. Ellipsis. Goodbye, Nick. Slam. <laughs> Judy, are, are, are you all right? Mm. Oh my, <laughs> we're making out right mm. now. Come on, get into the part, Eden. Get into the part. I'm not making out with Jack over the mic. You're a professional voice actor. Do your job. Mm. I'm not doing that. Mm. <laughs> I'm better now. Much better. End of part two. This is fucking amazing. I love this. Do I get through Judy now? <laughs> yes, and now I'm Nick. Never say goodbye. A Zootopia fan comic by Borba. Okay, boys and girls. What do you guys want? I want pineapple juice. Kiwi for me. Orange, please. Grape. Blueberry. Mr. Wild. Nice choice, Samson. Uh, I'll have one too. Yay. Isn't this going to be expensive for you, Mr. Wild? No worries, Monica. Junior Ranger Reserves funds will reimburse my expenses. Besides, I'm the treasurer, ain't I? He's like a fucking camp counselor. <laughs> what happened from cop to like camp counselor? Well, now that you kids know everything about this uh, great station, I'm going to show you a uh, Wonderful place. Uh, a wonderful place where. What's going on? Yahoo! Wee! Hooray! Yay, we! It looks like a VIP is coming here, and I think I know who it is. Hooray! Welcome, Mayor! <gasps> oh my fucking god! Hillary Clinton! I'm with her! I'm with her! Let's go! Mayor Ops! Yay! She's so beautiful and pretty! Mayor Ops! How pretty she is! Yoo hoo! She's so fucking hot, man! That ass is so much bigger than I remember! Dumb bunny! What? This voice? <laughs> Nicholas? Long time no see, Carrots. Or should I say, Your Honor? No, you you don't have to. By the way, I'm, I'm glad to see you're doing well. Oh, do you mean this? It's just my irresistible fox charm. 
It grows <laughs> over time, you know. <laughs> oh wait, he's not pregnant. Oh, you. I used to have a baby like that. I genuinely was 100% convinced that this was about to go the Mpreg route, and I was horrified. <laughs> Something wrong, Mayor Hops? No, not at all. I just found a longtime friend of mine. Sexy men, move out. Oh, wow. This is what I would call a mammal wall. There are reasons for this, Nick. Say, is it like this all the time? Believe me, this is just one of the downsides of becoming empowered. <laughs> Mr. Wild. Hey, this is not fair. Car, <laughs> er, Mr. Mayor, if you don't mind. Oh, it's Mrs. Mayor. Oh, sorry. Let the kids come closer, Wolverton. Yes, ma'am. You know Mayor Hops, Mr. Wild? Let's say she and I cracked a lot of criminal cases some time ago. Ten years to be exact. Ten years. Holy shit. The next entry is going to be fucking 40 years in the future. Wow. Is it true, Miss Mayor? Yes, it is, darling. Mr. Wild and I were cops. <laughs> And great buddies. What? 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 How do you even like, how are you on this? This doesn't feel like a sequel. How are they on good terms now? Time heals all wounds. And we're also one more thing, weren't we? Nick, please. But this part of our history is just water under the bridge now, right? Oh my God. All the fucking panels. Look at that fucking panels. Oh my God. That's beautiful. Um, air, Mr. Wild? Uh, well, bygones are bygones. Carrots, let me introduce you this adorable little bunch to you. So you finally became a junior ranger scout, right? Har har. How funny. I'm the leader of the Zootopia pack and a successful entrepreneur. Okay, kids, introduce yourselves. Shut the fuck up. Shut up. And a successful entrepreneur. I am rich. <laughs> Magnificent Lieutenant Samson Swinton. Great Major Barbara Bartson. Ten-star General Monica Moosebridge. Trooper Roger Rackineer. Nicholas Piperius Wild Jr. Proudly at your service, ma'am. Oh my god. He has a son. Nicholas Wild Jr.? Yep, he's my pride. Unless this little boy grows up to be gay, then I'm gonna disown him. Dad! Oh, you chose the gay son over the thought daughter, huh? Well, that's genetics, my dear. If I'm straight, then I have to have a straight son. Oh, Nick. He's so cute and handsome. And handsome. Oh, that's so weird, Judy. That's really weird. That's my child. Stop touching my child like that, Judy. Do not fuck. Son, Judy, please. <laughs> There's too many pages left of this for you to be saying that. Nick, your son is so handsome. Looks like you from 10 years ago. Maybe your son will support abortion. I'm so happy for you, Nick. And your wife, too? So you didn't fail to notice this. Of course. And I'm quite sure she's a very special woman. Yes, Carrots. She is. By the way, you're still stunningly <laughs> beautiful, Judy. I know I have a wife right now, but I just need to point out how sexy you are. That you are now more beautiful than ever. That I want to fuck your rabbit ass. Oh, thank you, Nick. I'm glad you want to fuck my rabbit ass, but I'm glad you have no hard feelings. Well, rest assured that I never had such feelings for you, sweetheart. Same here. Unfortunately, not all mammals think so. Huh? What do you mean? I'm talking about politics. What is going on right now? It's fucking Hunter Hunter, dude. This shit's turning into fucking Star Wars prequels right now. Almost all Zootopia citizens, even those who didn't vote for me, approve and do support my full mammal equality program. The very reason why I was elected. But there are these small radical groups called Antifa that are against this in integration and don't want me to be reelected. I know that ain't who I think it is, bro. What? Nazis? They are doing Seek Hail! Zootopia Nazis! There are pro preds and pro praise groups, each with their own twisted agendas. But they all have only one goal to overthrow Zootopia's democratic government and impose their prejudices and biased views. Oh my god! Look at her fucking thighs! Holy shit! The thighs are crazy, though. The thighs are kind of crazy, though. Like, can we talk about that? That'll never gonna happen. <laughs> <laughs> That'll never gonna happen. I think so. They're just a handful of delusional weirdos. Very dangerous weirdos, anyway. Hmm. This explains your bodyguards, Bert. Er, Judy, wouldn't it be safer for you to just stay away from public places? Believe me, if I do so, the extremists will think 
They've dis defeated me and become stronger. No, Nick. I'm not gonna bury myself in a burrow. I'd rather- What the fuck is this even about anymore? We're getting into the lore, the crazy fucking lore. Excuse me, your honor, but they just arrived. The Nazis! Hope I'm not slowing you down. Not at all, Nick. Please come with me and see why I came here today. The place is clear, sir. Good work, mammals. Everything is ready to welcome. Oh my god. Look at the booty lines. The booty lines, bro. What the hell? That's why I voted for it personally. Like, I didn't really read into her policies or anything. This is the reason I voted. Same reason I voted for Hillary. Mayor Hop's wife and children. She has kids. What? Hello, honey. Hi, Mom and Judy. Mommy, Judy, I missed you. I miss you too, my cupcake. I just want to eat you up. Mm. I was so, so homesick. I love you, honey. I love you too, pumpkin. M -m -m Mr. Wilday? Hi, Shan. Um, I mean, um, Mrs. Hops. I don't know if you're gonna believe me or not, but I am deeply sorry for what I said and did to you that morning. I was a major jerk, and I've done you one wrong. It was one of the worst things I've did in my life. Well, I mean, I really, really hope you'll forgive me someday. One piece live action acting right there. Man just did a YouTuber apology. It's, a, it's all right, all right, Nick. Let's call me Sh Sh Shay. Thank you. Thank you so much, Shay. Stu and B Bonnie sent you many hugs. Gosh, it's been a while since the last time I was at the Burrows. I'll pay them a visit as soon as possible. I've seen your family on the news, but it's a pleasure to meet your kids in person. Thanks. Let me introduce them to you. This is Rafiki. <laughs> 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 That's the Animal Kingdom expedition guy, dude. That's the monkey from fucking Lion King. Now I put two and two together, to be honest. I didn't know that. Hey, this is Rafiki. He's the captain of his school's paw ball team. <laughs> Say hi to Miss Mr. Wilday, Rafiki. Hi. Nice to meet you, Rafiki. I uh I abused your your mother. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. I'm okay with that, to be honest. Say, what about becoming a junior ranger scout son so I can make sure that that trauma is generational? Wow, it'd be way past cool, Mr. Wild. And th th this young lady is Mulan. Mulan? Are you fucking kidding me right now? They adopted an African and a fucking Chinese like kid. That's what they did. Say hi, sweetie. Ha ha ha. She's a little shy in Chinese. They are so adorable. Jay, this handsome boy is Nick's son. Nick Jr. Oh, how cute he is. What would you like to do when you grow up, my dear? Stop. 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 I'd like to help to make the world a better place. Well, well. I'm sure they've heard these words before. <laughs> oh no, really? Poor me. Thinking I was being original when I taught my kid that lesson. Tisk, tisk, tisk. Your honor, it's time to go. The suit part of his body is completely normal proportions. <laughs> and then it's like just pushing everything else out the top. Who needs a watch with all these watch mammals around? I hope all these security measures are not really necessary, but better safe than sorry, right? Just like wearing a condom, which we didn't do in our relationship. Anyway, they're just doing their duty, like us when we were cops, remember? Of course, Carrots. I'll never forget our time as cops. <laughs> Me neither. I remember all that police brutality we did. Um, er, well, I think it's time to say goodbye. Uh, good, good, goodbye, it, it seems so. Goodbye, Nick. My friend. <laughs> Please, never, never say goodbye to me again. Judy, my friend. Look at those fat cheeks. The thighs. It's like a chicken. Agreed. I'll never say that again. Oh. And if you ever need anything from Zootopia City Hall. Now that you said that, Junior Ranger Scouts are in a new of a- Scouts? <laughs> Junior Ranger Scouts are in need of a new headquarters. You smart fox. All right, just go to my office. We'll see what I can do for your scouts. Especially that one handsome one. That little son of yours. Deal. Nice. See ya, Nick. Mayor Hops, just a minute for CNN, please. Viva Mayor Hops, yay. Long live Mayor Hops. Mayor Hops is a great mammal, isn't she, Dad? Yes, I'm sure she is, Junior. 
I am sure that she <laughs> is. Well, now, boys and gals, now that everything has been said and done, well, what was I saying to you kiddos a dozen minutes ago? <sighs> hmm, oh, yes. Are you ready to know a very amusing place? Where is it, Dad? Why, you know where, Junior. It's our amusement park, the wild times. Never say goodbye, the end. But wait, there's more. Never say goodbye, extra. A Zootopia fan comic by Borba. Wait, is she gonna get killed? This is JFK. Julia Hobbs is gonna get fucking shot by the Nazis. Dun dun. Dun dun. Dun dun. Dun dun. Dun dun. dun. Oh my god, I was right! Blam! No fucking way! Oh my god! She was fucking killed! No way! Judy FK! What the fuck? And if you wanna assassinate- Wait, um... And if you enjoyed that video, comment down below with other weird comics or things that we should do, and leave a like on this video and subscribe! Thanks for a patron! Wow! Alejandro Paredes, Asmus Bioga, Atomic Leon, Bento, Kamlu, Communism is when People's iPhone, Cosmic Dega, Crystal Bunny, Daryl Herb, James, Frozen Spaghetti, Gabriel Granados, Gub, Stargazer, Gummy Brain Rot, Gunny Snow, Jonathan, Helio, I Love Spilling the Milk, Isaiah Alfred, Kamui, Night VDB, Lilac Moon, My Artistry, Master Nate, Misty Skies, Native, Obama Gaming, Omega Waffles, Puffles, Remuel, and Steven Sanchez, Terrence Sills, Useless Grunt, Val Explicit, Wyatt Lime, Yahir Sanchez.